Welcome to part one of a four-part series on processing our chickens. This year, Tracy and I, uh, we raised 25 chickens, and now we have to process them. Uh, four-part series, part one is gonna be dispatching the chickens. Uh, part two, we're gonna be processing them. Part three, we're gonna be shrink wrapping them. Part four will be a recap. Kinda let you know how things went and lessons learned. This video. This video is not for everyone. And uh, first thing I'd like to do is I'd like to thank my friends, Mike and Carolyn, for coming, coming over and helping us. Uh, this is not an easy process. Warning, we will be dispatching chickens in this video. If it's not something you wanna see, go to parts two, three, and four and learn, the, learn what we learned uh, on the rest of the process. This is also a, a compilation video uh, in which uh, I took a lot of video that day and I tried to bring all the dispatching and put it in one spot. And the reason for that is I didn't want to show like the perfect way to do it. This process, dispatching a chicken is not perfect, it's not pretty, and uh, it's messy. Mike can attest to that because he got pooped on twice, so keep that in mind. With all that being said, uh, warning, this is very graphic, and uh, I'm not gonna do any music, I'm not gonna do any of that stuff, um, and like I said, it's gonna be a compilation, so there's gonna be a, a number of shots just all kind of stuck together. So, let's get on with it. There's nothing. Okay, I'm having problems seeing with the glare. You and gotta get out of the sun. Okay, I'm good. I'm good. Okay, so I'm gonna explain it while we do it. Maybe. Kind of big, I think, this to set up. So we're gonna go right above his. Right here. Yep. Good enough, yep. I'd say so. Alright. I think these combs are too small. Good job. 